think the president's got a sound proposal for, for common sense uh, gun control. Uh, but I have to say that, that, you know, in my family, we have a, a, a personal perspective that I think, uh, unfortunately, far too many families are experiencing in America today. Uh, at a very young age, my, my, my cousin Brian was shot nine times. Uh, he was a, a new father. So I watched his daughter grow up without a dad. Uh, he wasn't shot with an assault weapon, but he was shot by someone who should not have had a gun and did not have one legally. Uh, so I know the, the pain that families feel uh, who have confronted that, that tragedy. And I think there's a lot that we can do to make sure that that, that does not happen uh, as often as it does in today's society both in the inner cities and elsewhere. Uh, you know, I, I think that uh, Carolyn McCarthy and Carolyn Maloney uh, from New York both have very sound bills that, that offer meaningful change and common sense change uh, in the gun laws in this country. I'm a co-sponsor of both those efforts. Uh, we, look, we, we need to reinstitute the assault weapons ban. I understand the Second Amendment, and I respect that, but, but you do not have... Uh, the right to have a military-style assault rifle. Uh, you do not have the right to have a, a large magazine uh, clip that holds 30 rounds. That's not part of the Second Amendment right for personal security or, you know, it's not something that someone in the sportsman uh, uh, arena would, would necessarily have to have. But, but I think what is best about the bills that I've co-sponsored is the degree to which background checks uh, serve to keep guns out of the hands of criminals and, and perhaps those with, uh, with mental disabilities that should not be in possession of a firearm. So I think we can do a lot to, to make our streets safer uh, without, without abolishing or, or overriding the Second Amendment, but using common sense approaches uh, to keep our kids safe keep our family safe.